Hello everybody, this is iPotter9008 here doing a Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare tutorial on um, cheat codes and a special mod I'm using called PezBot which allows you to spawn NPCs in single player multiplayer. Yeah, no, that sounds weird, but whatever. Uh, just pretty much Google spawn NPCs in COD 4 multiplayer and you'll probably get this mod. So anyway, but enables to do, to, it, it, to be able to use cheats, you have to open up the console by pressing tiled. And you type forward slash dev map mp, and I'm going to do shipment. And I'm doing free for all. It's going to go to shipment. Now it's going to be pretty much just the same map, except it'll be able to use cheat codes on it, which are also enabled in the console. I'm going to do um, three main cheat codes. Uh, let's use this. Okay. Once it finishes this, I'm going to show you the cheat codes. Well, actually, I can do it right now. Okay. Let's do this. Forward slash G-O-D. Hit enter, and that will turn God Mode on. Um, forward slash J-U-M-P underscore H-E-I-G-H-T. Oops. And you want to set it to 1, 0, 0, 0. That'll make it so you can jump super, super high. And the next one will be player underscore sus tain no space a m m o you want to set that to one hit enter and you can close the console and now if you were looking at HUD, my HUD just then my head of display you'll see that my clip never emptied a single Unlimited ammunition. Now we're gonna jump. And we're gonna land and we're not gonna take any damage because we have God Mode on. And as you can see, I can jump abnormally high. Ooh, broken leg. So now we're gonna do the fun one. This is what my friend Trevor is really gonna like to watch. That would be fully automatic RPG. But in order to be able to do that, you do have to aim because if you just do it the normal way, it'll go a little bit slower because the RPG always has to aim when you shoot it. So, you want to aim first. And that'll just automatically give you fully automaticness. So, we're going to jump again. almost blow myself up. <laughs> so, but yeah. So now we're going to spawn some NPCs. Um, you press B if you have the mod installed correctly. You press B and there will be four commands you can put in instead of just the default three. You press four and you can add either bots to allies or axes and the cool thing about this mod is um, the bots will kill each other the bots will choose perks and they will use kill streaks. You can um, also, if you're doing team deathmatch or some team related mode, you can spawn NPCs to allies if you're on allies or axis if you're on the axis side and they will not attack you. They will fight with you. They will not attack each other. So, but this is free for all, so I'm not going to choose either. I'm just going to go with the top one and add 16 bots. There they are. As you can see, they all go crazy and they start to attack each other. So, we're gonna aim at the RPG now and jump.
I apparently cannot land on these boxes. Oh wait, yes I can. So. And if you can hear me, I just won that match in about six seconds. Okay, maybe it was longer than that, but it was very quick. And I'm going to do another match real quick because I want to level up. So we're going to leave game because if you just let it go again, it'll give me the wrong map. So we're just going to type. And if you press up, you can get recently selected console commands. You don't have to retype all that. So, I'm going to go with SAS again because I just like them. Free for all. Um, God mode. Player sustain ammo. Jump height 1000. Let's do this. And spawn some NPCs again so I can level up really quick. Because I really want to do that. with me in here, so that's pretty awesome. Oh, I'm almost captain two or one actually, so we're gonna have to do another one, folks. Don't get too impatient with me here. I just need to level up real quick. I'm so close to leveling up. And this is a good way to power level too. Yes, this is a very, very cheap way to power level, obviously. Free for all. Let's do this. up all the same time. That's what you call the Yep. So that's one of the coolest mob Ooh, finally bandolier! I wanted that perk so bad. Well that and overkill. I want overkill even worse, but bandolier's good because I hate not having any ammunition when you start out. So um there we have it. That is um, the Pezbot mod, which I don't remember who made it, but it wasn't me. So I guess when you find it, if you want to find it at all, give the guy credit in your videos, which I'm probably not going to do this time, but uh, it wasn't made by me. So I guess that's kind of credit. <laughs> I didn't make the mod. It is a fun mod, though, and makes it very easy to level up. The only thing is you can't actually keep all the stuff you win in Pezbot. But it is good practice, and it's just funny. It's LOL kind of stuff. But, yeah. So, um, that was my tutorial on how to use cheats. And how to own and take up people's time watching you level up. Because you probably didn't want to see all that. But, at least you did get the gist of everything I was saying, I hope. 
Um, oh, also, I never showed you guys how to load the mod. If you get the mod, it will come with instructions on how to load it automatically with your game. Um, but if you don't feel like doing that, um, you just put it where the mods go. I don't remember exactly where that is. I might do a tutorial on that. I might not. Probably not, though. But once you install it, there will be instructions on how to install it. Um, just go into the mod section, click PezBot, and launch. There, there you go. Easy as pie. And it's not hard to install either. It takes like five seconds once you download it. It's, it's not hard. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, and uh, hope to come out with more tutorial videos, and maybe just gameplay videos. I don't know. But my internet's really slow, and my computer's crap, so I probably need to do a whole lot. Uh, thanks for watching, anyway. Bye bye.